Well, hello, party people, and welcome to Traveling for Food with Jay. As you know, I am your girl, Jay, and I know it's been a while, but listen, come in here with me. It's called Checkmate Detroit. This is a black-owned business, so I had to stop in, see what it was about, you know, and listen, y'all, I did not expect this at all, but this place was a little, hmm... The decor and everything was decent. I liked it. It was cute. It's a cute spot if you're looking for um, like the ambiance of a joint. You just want to go somewhere cute. I didn't get much footage of how the place looked because it was a reservation going on. It was pretty packed in there. So I didn't want to have my camera in people's faces. But yes, um, it is a cute spot. The tables are really small though. That's why I didn't get any food on top of look at these prices here. Like I was a little confused like okay i get it like y'all want to make y'all money but baby these prices is not giving no i'm sorry but i did uh get a drink because why not you know like i didn't go there for no reason so i grabbed me a drink but please screen record pause do what you need to do i was trying to go slow so you guys can get a, a really good look at what they're offering and things of that nature but i probably started going fast towards the end so please forgive me but like i said you can pause screen record or screenshot so that you can see what they're offering here and i got everything from the food to the cocktails to the dessert beer wine all of it even their spirits which is basically like showing you what exact brand of liquor that they have so like the cognacs they'll have that all under categories and stuff like that so just chill look at this menu and then you can decide if you want to come in and spend the money on the food i apologize because y'all know i love me some food and i be trying to get y'all to see what's good and where to go and where not to go but this place here you're just gonna have to chance it on your own go in and see if you you know want to try the food or not because i didn't i apologize again but i had to get y'all some type of content because i have been neglecting you so sorry I also want to mention that they had a live DJ. I went on a Saturday. I think I should mention that. I went on a Saturday and they had a live DJ in there. It was pretty loud. So I don't know if that's a deal breaker for you or not. It was pretty loud. So you got to kind of talk to your server loudly and vice versa. She kind of got to talk to you loudly because it was so much going on. But that was a Saturday. I don't know if they have live music throughout the week or not. But yeah. Also... Um, when y'all see how much I spent on my drinks, I don't need nobody in the comment section saying, oh my God, you could have got a bottle for that. Because baby, I went out for the experience. And yes, I could have gotten a bottle at the store. But honey, this is my money, not yours. So go and check the spot out yourself. And then we can go from there, okay? Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. See ya.